Hey YouTube, welcome back, guys. So uh, today I'm going to uh, show you guys on how to uh, transfer your uh, MacBook to another MacBook by using this uh, migration assistant. So it's just uh, go to your uh, Finders on your upper right hand corner and search for uh, migration assistant. So it'll be this one right here. And all you need to do is just uh, double click it or click on it. And it says uh, use migration assistant to transfer information, data, computer setting, and apps to this uh, MacBook from another Mac. So this one is the old Mac that I'm going to transfer the, all the data and uh, program and everything to the new one. So it says a window PC, a time machine backup, or a disk. You can also transfer information from this Mac to another Mac. All other app will quit when you uh, click continue. So by the way, you want to go somewhere that you're going to have a good connection or that is uh, near your uh, Wi-Fi router. So it's more stable. So all you need to do is just uh, click on uh, continue right here and everything is going to shut down or close all your uh, application or software. It says uh, closing application and uh, lock out one moment. So there you go. So be sure to uh, click on to another Mac, okay? Because this one is the source. So you want to copy from this to another Mac. So make sure you choose the third one down and click on continue. So it's going to search for uh, the, both of them. You got to be on the same uh, Wi-Fi network, okay? Currently, I'm on the McDaddy uh, Linksys. So it's going to discover your other uh, new MacBook right now. So let me go to the new MacBook Pro and then uh, see. So on my new MacBook, it says uh, Jeff uh, MacBook Pro, which is my other one right here. And all you need to do is just uh, click on continue. So if you have a lot of files and data, it's going to take a while, okay? And that is the code that you need to enter from uh, the other uh, computer, which is the source. So this one is the destination. So um, let me go back to uh, my old MacBook Pro and then uh, check it out. And then uh, this is uh, what it says right here, same number. So all you need to do is just uh, click on uh, continue. Make sure the number matches. And transferring your information. So that we're just going to let it uh, transfer. I'm not sure how long this is going to take. I think mine has about 500 uh, gigabyte of uh, storage as uh, it's being used. So, and this is a uh, one terabyte of uh, storage. So it might take a couple hours or even uh, 10 to 12 hours, depends your files. And we're going to come back and then check on it. Uh, but uh, be sure both of your uh, computers are plugged in. And uh, this is uh, what it shows on the computer right now, the new one. Select the information to transfer, and it is uh, calculating right now. So application, other files and folders, system and network. So if you want to transfer all those stuff, be sure to check on all those, since uh, all of them are checked already. And it says uh, looking for incompatible uh, software. Well, hopefully uh, all the softwares are compatible, so. So I'm just uh, going to click on continue and see what happened. So I need to set a password. Let me set it. All right, so once you set the password, click on set password. And then uh, now it's going to allow you to go and hit the continue. And you got to agree on all this uh, stuff right here, term and condition. I agree and uh, agree to the MacOS uh, software license agreement. Click on agree. 
and now it's doing its thing to transfer your uh, all our data to the new one now and uh, we're just gonna come back and then uh, check on it when it is uh, fully finished by the way it also says uh, connect a thunderbolt or an ethernet cable may transfer data faster but uh, since I don't have any of those right now I'm not going to worry about it so and uh, this is uh, what it says on my uh, old computer or the old MacBook Pro well I'm checking on my computer it says uh, about 8 hours and uh, 46 minutes remaining so yeah wow that's gonna take a while so you're gonna come back and then uh, check on it probably tomorrow morning right now it's uh, 11 20 all right so now it's the next morning it's a migration complete migration to new mac is complete from my uh, old macbook pro let me go check out the other one the new one all right on the new one it says software update is trying to authenticate user enter password for the user uh, set up user to allow this uh, password so i'm gonna enter it and then press ok and then uh, press ok Okay, on the new one, say uh, migration summary. Something you should be aware of uh, after complete your migration. Some files from application, or oh, the Hero Packer, could not be uh, transferred. And then I'm gonna hit uh, continue on the new computer, the MacBook Pro. And it says uh, migration completed. And just click on done, you should be finished. And right here it shows uh, accessibility. Click on that now. Sign in with your Apple ID. So anyway, I need to set this up. And then uh, this is how you transfer from your old MacBook to your new MacBook. Anyway, hopefully you guys uh, give a thumbs up and then uh, like the video. Please uh, be sure to hit that subscribe button, turn on that bell for notification, or uh, drop in the comments on below. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you guys on the next uh, video, guys. Like always, peace.